welcome to yet another fantastic episode of the Juwakazi Show where we dig deeper into the lives of entrepreneurs and how they got to where they are. And I am in the heart of Nairobi West and as you can see hapa nyuma yangu kuna gas nyingi sana. I'm at a gas depot and, and this entrepreneur will tell his story about how he came from grass to grace. Of course, I am your host Wangoi Nganga. Karibu. Hi, how are you? Karibu sana jua kazi show. Welcome, welcome, welcome. And we are so delighted to have you on our show. We are so delighted to hear from you. Utuambia story yako, penye umetoka. First things first, what is your name? My name is Samuel Wetuka. Samuel Wetuka. Karibu sana. Yes. And what do you do? What is your business all about? Okay, my business is all about gas supply. I do supply gas to the households, hotels, and uh, since it's a basic thing, I think everybody uses gas. So anyone yes, yes. who wants to cook, wants energy at their home, yes. I think I'm there to serve them. Hapo ligonga ndipo, sindio? How did you come up with that brilliant idea? Mm, first and foremost, I can't say that uh, I wanted to sell gas in the first place, mm -hmm. but um, just an idea that came along the way. There's something else that I used to do because I didn't start with us. Mm -hmm. uh, I was doing something else. Then, uh, okay, I was uh, undo the guy. Oh, you were undo the guy. Yes. So, Lianza na biashara ya undo the? Ndiyo sasa uka elevate. Elevate. So, I think the uh, guys who are using, who are, who are selling the gas, eh? they used to sell me to the plants, the supply for them. Then I got interested. So, after getting the interest, I said that I think I need to try such words of wisdom. So that means you thought outside the box, Sindio. Lakini ni kulize. Ibi ashara yako sai. Upo na gas kibao. How much capital did you use to start? Ama, if you're not comfortable, uli toa api yodo. Jui ibi ashara yako yani mesimama kabisa. Okay, what I can say is that, I mean, you start small than you think, right? So you can't start with a bigger capital because uh, money is a, is, a, is a limited resource, so mm -hmm. like you have to start small, then start knowing on how you can multiply that, mm -hmm. so that it grows into something big. Mm -hmm. So I think, um, minimally, I can say I started with a hundred k. Wow, a hundred thousand shillings. Nandio ika grow, ika grow, ika kuwa this whole big business. Na hiyo 100,000, ebu clarify, ilitoka kwa biyashara ya ndudhi, sindio? Yeah, exactly. Ama did you get help from anyone, ulipewa dona mse, kwa mwambia, eh, manze ni patia kakaloni hivi? No, what I can say, this thing is start by strategizing. Like, for example, I have come with an idea, I want to sell gas. Yes. And then, from there, you start planning on how am I going to raise this capital. So from the ndudhi business, I think I used to Self, self, self. Oh, wow. Then after a certain period, because mm -hmm. I, I set myself a limit mm -hmm. that I want to set between this period and this period, then after that, I keep it up. So clearly, do to acquire entrepreneur, you need to have discipline. See what do you say? You need to have discipline, eh? Especially with your finances. Mm -hmm. Very, very discipline. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's amazing. Sam, honestly speaking, I've interviewed so many entrepreneurs, eh? And your story is very, very unique. Because unasema story ya kusave, story ya kukuwa na discipline, ni kuulize, that means, au kuwa unapata challenges ukianza? Challenges are there, you can never miss challenges in anything. Sometimes there's a plan, like I want to do this, then another thing pops in, you find that you deviate your finances, but end of the day, once you have that dream, you have that focus and you want to do something, I mean, however much challenges come in, you have to make sure that you stick to that. Yeah, I'm saying that normally say, uh, do not lose the sight of an animal for a national spirit. Can you please say that again? Listen guys, listen to the wisdom that come from this entrepreneurs. Please say that again. You should not uh, lose the sight of an animal for mm -hmm. a national spirit. Like if you know that your focus is there, mm -hmm. just focus on that. In, a, in as much as something else comes in, yeah. don't deviate your mind. Yeah. Just focus on what you want to go. Mm -hmm. yeah. So challenges will always be there. They will always be there. Yeah. But don't lose your focus. Sindio? Exactly. All right. Thank you so much, Sam. 
and short shortly to, to Narodi Sawa. But guys, we are going to take a short commercial break and we'll be back with so much more, so so much fun. Do not go anywhere, we'll be right back. Uh, thank you for having me again at the Jua Kazi Show. Um, when it comes to small and medium enterprise uh, business and uh, empowering the same, uh, we look at um, some of the key areas that uh, any MSME needs to focus on and these are in line with uh, the four P's uh, as de described by Kotler. Well, I'll actually expand them to five P's, which is uh, product, price, place, promotion and people. Um, so for every enterprise, you need to define what is your product, what is this unique selling proposition of a product or service that you have to offer to the people um, that is filling a certain gap in the market. And so when you define your product, that sets a beacon to the major operations of the, uh, of the, um, of the business. And then uh, two is price. How are you pricing whatever product you're offering the market? And so you have to make sure that you have a competitive price that one does not um, show your product as a weak product but still is affordable to your target market um, the three and the third most important thing is uh, uh, place location 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 the major thing when it comes to considering where to set up your business it could be physical location and it could be um, online location um, so whichever location you decide to be where your customers or your market can reach you make sure that you get an elaborate uh, location that um, is accessible and that um, serves the purpose and that is as practical as possible for your target niche market um, the, th the fourth P would be uh, promotion uh, the promotion is now how do you get um, your product known how do you get your service known to your target market how do you make sure that um, uh, whoever you're targeting uh, as an off taker of uh, your product is is a uh, is aware of how to reach you so the promotion is very important in terms of adver advertising um, below the line above the line um, whatever sort of advertising works for you you better you need to define that so that um, your product is known by your target market and the final uh, P is people so it is uh, who is your target market how are you targeting them uh, why did you settle on this niche group of people are they be, uh, is your target market based on a location uh, segmentation uh, as you segment your market is it based on uh, a particular niche like affordability what what um, parameters are you using to target your market to, to, to set out your own niche your target market and so that is a uh, that's one of the uh, uh, most important uh, thing also to have a good a good grasp of who am I going to target with this product or service and uh, those are your five P's that will assist you uh, take your business to the next level so thank you very much and uh, this is the Jua Kazi show Welcome back guys, thank you so much for staying tuned in and of course we have more questions for Sam, we want to know how he got to this, this, this amazing, amazing place that he is in. Nikona Soli Moja Sam, Nairobi Tech and Riote, why this location? Why this location? Yes, why this location? To go up, I said 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 to go to Nairobi West. Yes, yes. Born in Nairobi West. I found myself here. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, this is the area that I started uh, my hustle. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think, you know, you cannot be successful everywhere. I may, yeah. I may be successful here, but when I go somewhere else, yeah. I find that maybe things will be tough and so on. Mm -hmm. So for me, I think it was the best place for me. Mm -hmm. And uh, I said that I need to build my future from this place. And there's a lot of customers. So ulitafuta the need, na ukaju hapa ndio watu wako, sindio? Ama do you struggle to find customers or they're right there? Customers, you have to look for them mm -hmm. because you can't just start business and uh, wait for them to come. Yes. I mean, you also need to put in strategies that will make sure uh, you get the class. Mm -hmm. uh, what I mean is, you have to go out mm -hmm. and uh, search for them. Like for me, the strategy, some of the strategies I think uh, I do make flyers. 
Oh wow. People are just to, to, to the residential homes, mm -hmm. to the hotels. Mm -hmm. I also use uh, online marketing. Mm -hmm. And uh, through that, I think clients just come and find yourself selling food. So, Sam Amesema, he just doesn't sit there and wait for customers. He uses flyers anatumia online marketing pia word of mouth so kikatua hapo kingojia customers wakuje you you're not going to succeed sam si nikianza biashara yangu kuje kwa my financial advisor kwa my mentor because no you are doing so well eh si ndio that, that's amazing that's amazing i have a question do you have employees ama unafanya kazi peke yako no 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 you can't do everything alone you mm -hmm. need support you need support because i believe in the power of uh, delegation you see yes. Uh, the number of people I could get to when I'm alone mm -hmm. is not the same as those one I'll get to when I'm having a team. Because mm -hmm. I also believe in teamwork. Yes. When you have a team that is supportive, a team that uh, helps you to achieve whatever you want to achieve, mm -hmm. I think you're good to go. So I have people who help me to, to distribute the gas, mm -hmm. go for it, mm -hmm. do the marketing and so on. Absolutely. So that means in as much as uko na profit yako lazima ndo ingine inarudi unalipa watu si ndio yeah yeah oh but that's amazing so teamwork makes the dream work yeah. even though inafaa kwa si ndio if you do alone mm -hmm. it will take you a very a very long uh, period for mm -hmm. you to achieve whatever you want to do but if you have a team mm -hmm. that is dedicated a team that is supportive mm -hmm. basically you gonna make it you're going to make it single yes. and do you ever think that you want to expand am i you're comfortable with where you are i don't no, know no, no, no. Mm -hmm. you know you, the moment i'll realize that i'm comfortable then that will be the end of me i'll be yes. expanding it, even becoming the biggest distributor even in the whole country absolutely and nothing yeah. is impossible yeah. in this world so yes. i mean my focus my dream is to make sure that i capture the whole of nairobi mm -hmm. i even go uh, outside nairobi and na sasa unaweza kuwa uko na kasiri yako kwenye unatuanga ukiri unajua unatoa hizi gas zako wapi eh si the distributors yes uh, i mean si these companies and the company yes. uh, gas they do have uh, distributors yes. so those distributors are the ones who sell to us we sell to who are the retailers because yes. me I do it on retail I don't do it on myself oh, so okay this is retail and yeah. not wholesale yeah, not wholesale mm. so what I do I get it from the distributors yes and uh, after getting it from the distributors I think I sell it to my customers that's amazing so my sama you do retail not wholesale not so wholesale. the distributors supply you uh, with the, the gas na sasa ebook mimi naona hizi gas hazifanani kuna ndogo kuna zingine ziko na shape nyingine unaweza tu explain ya briefly why they they are very very different kama hii unaona the the base is different and uh, this one the base is different so is there like one that's preferable ama zote they serve the same purpose mm, i think uh, it's all about branding mm -hmm. I and mean, uh, each and every company have got their brand mm -hmm. like for example if you go for total yes. their color their mm -hmm. style of cylinders and so on yes. go to africa which is the uh, shelwa okay it's also blue. that that's their brand each and every company has got their brand so it depends with the, what the client prefers okay. there's a client who says i'm a total die hard okay. there's a client who says i'm an african die hard so you can't change them so that's why you see i do distribute all of them so that i serve each and every customer That's amazing. And you have so much information. Indo kazi ulenda kusomea shule, si ndio? No. Uh-huh. This is not uh, what you studied for. Everything I just learned along the way. Mm -hmm. uh, when I started it, and then uh, I focused and started learning everything. I love wow. That. So your whatever you studied for is completely different to It's what you're doing now. Yeah. Mm. It's completely different. Okay. Yeah. So that means hata mtu akipata uko nje a business opportunity si lazima ikuwe kitu umesomea si ndio si lazima ikuwe kitu umesomea mm. yeah. and basically sometimes unajua before somebody realizes who they are and what they want yes uh, you must sometimes go through the wrong direction because me mm. for me uh, i studied something different but then i found my potential in something different um, see, so my potential was in business yes. but what i studied mm -hmm. uh, in as much as it's also helping because i can't say that it doesn't help me. Mm -hmm. but uh, Had I known, I would yes. have gone for business. Yes. You get it? Yes. So sometimes you may study something different, but maybe your potential is somewhere else. That's so it's amazing. about you to sort such yourself and see what potential you have inside you. Thank you so much, Sam. So, you can use a question. You can use a question. 
Yeah. Umeipata yes. na umechukua. Yes. Sitakusaidia ku expand biashara. Exactly. Si ndio? In fact I'm, I'm for the for the idea. Si ndio? I thank the president for his that. Absolutely. And uh, this uh, what I can I can just say is uh, this is something that uh, each and every youth who is listening to me right now. Mm -hmm. I mean take this thing positive. Don't take it in a negative way. Remove politics out of it. This is something that can help you grow. Like for example, if you are given a limit of 500, uh, try as much as you can to push that thing to the next level. Absolutely. Like for me, in as much as it may sound little, mm -hmm. but I'm looking at the positive part of it. Like mm -hmm. let me just start growing this, mm -hmm. growing this. Yes. Teganeza my my, my credit record, yes. then from there, I think I'll be able to get some big amounts. Thank you so much, Sam. You have such words of wisdom. So, Apo Inja, anyone, and Sam Amisamai, if you want to be an entrepreneur, have discipline. Try the saving culture. Do not lose focus. And think positively, think broadly. Usi jingishe koka kokun. Think outside the box. Even if you never studied for that and you see there's a, you know, there's a niche somewhere, a problem that needs to be solved, Pick it up. Create your own, own, own opportunities and don't just sit there and wait for them to come. Sam, last parting shot, I'm here to go up so that they can come at Chikwegas exactly where you are and the name na wakita kukupata wata kupata wapi. Hey guys, my name is Samuel Wetuka, the entrepreneur of, uh, uh, the, the, the greatest entrepreneur, I believe I'm a great entrepreneur. So, uh, I want to tell you that I run a company called Royal Coca Limited. And uh, the company is located right now in Nairobi West and uh, we are believing that the company is going to grow and get to all the outskirts of Nairobi. So anytime you need gas from around here, Nairobi West, Langata, supply even to Kilelesho, just have our contacts, then you will get gas supply to you. Thank you so, so much. Thank you so much guys for tuning in. Asante ni sana mmesikiza Sam, mmesikiza all his words of wisdom. And of course, we have more and more entrepreneurs lined up for you. So do not ever go anywhere. Always stay tuned because we have more and more to educate you. Sasa mimi, nataka kuuza gas. Sawa, so can I say goodbye? Muniona in action. Na mkikuja leo, mutapata mimi. Hamutapata Sam. Thank you so much guys. On to the next episode. I have been your host, Wango Inganga.